generally speaking, this winter is going to be pretty much what you see, what you've seen is what you'll get. And what we've seen here in Calgary lately has been dry and warm. And an El Nino climate pattern will bring more of the same. Professor of Geography John Yakel says we'll probably see this weather from January to spring, saying that if we continue to see this little precipitation, it can have fairly serious consequences for the springtime. It's very, very easy to get uh, wildfires started up early like we saw um, we've seen in past springs, uh, particularly Fort McMurray a number of years ago, that was a, a very early spring forest fire. So uh, being this dry really spells some, some, you know, some serious consequences and some, some higher risk for, spring, for forest fires in the spring, that's for sure. And Yakel says global warming makes a climate pattern like El Nino more intense. We'll see warmer Chinooks, stronger winds, warmer air temperature and lower humidity levels. We will see more frequent extreme weather. Yakel says a hallmark signature of climate change is an increase in variability. What we're finding with climate change, um, with the Arctic getting warmer, we're finding that the jet stream is just not behaving the same way as it used to. The jet stream is much more wavier and it, it, it goes up and down kind of like a skipping rope from the, from the north to the south. And, and with that brings long periods of, of normally warm weather and then we'll get the occasional long period of, of, of cold weather as well. In Calgary, Danina Falkenberg, City News.